the UAE Pavilion here. How, how are they uh, welcome as a, a, a government which is not necessarily a top on human rights and freedom of speech? What, what's the idea behind uh, having them participate? I think every government has their pluses and minuses, and we all know about how different governments function. But I think that the thing that's great about art is that it helps cross bridges, and it helps a communication and a dialogue develop. So I'm excited to have governments that are working their way through a process and for us to be able to share their art and some of their traditions okay. and develop that and see where that goes. And, and have they been open with you about what they're trying to do to uh, make it more democratic? They've been open. I, I'm not involved in their political world. I'm only involved in their art world. And they're very open, and I know that their artists are able to produce a lot of works. Like if you look at the videos, they're fairly cutting edge in videos, and they're not they're not hiding behind their work. Like I mean, in China or in North Korea, in the past we've seen um, work that is very dictated by the government. Okay. And the work that they brought to this show, which I think was really interesting, was yeah. not dictated work. It was not. Um, governmental posters that really are what we saw in Russia or we see it coming out of North Korea today or China in the past.